Well, welcome to Mike and Velma's. Um, we are the big yellow house on the hill. It's probably the largest house in the hood. By far, it's probably the nicest. If you're coming to visit us and you're coming from San Rafael, then make sure you turn left at this sign about halfway up the hill. This is a little closer view of our house. Again, it's the yellow one. And this would be looking up from the valley, I guess you might say, from the view side of our place, which would be the front. This is our entrance through the front door, up the first flight of steps. Actually, this room here, this hallway, has this big, huge skylight, so if you want to do indoor clothes dryer, we have some clothes lines down here that work fairly well. Now we're looking down the stairway that leads us to our outside door. All right, here we are. We are now in the master bedroom. Um, I'm here to tell you that this king-size bed, I don't know if you'll be able to see in the video, but this king-size bed is the biggest bed I have ever been in my entire life. This thing is absolutely huge. This is just undescribable. And we have fair sized closets, plenty of room for Thelma and I to hide our stuff. And moving right along, we have a laundry facilities. I forget what you call it, but this is where we do our laundry. This being the banos or bathroom, as we would say. Um, lots of little storage places. Good sink. Mikey in the mirror. And we are complete with the large shower. And a suicide shower and a place to put your soaps and all that kind of good stuff. All in all, it's a really nice shower. And just all the rooms except for the bathroom do have really nice views, so if you just want to lay back and enjoy the view, this is a very, very nice place to do it. We have uh, an extremely nice living room. Um, again, we have very nice furniture. It's done quite well. Andrea, our landlord, has put a lot of effort, her and her husband, Manuel, put a lot of effort in here to make this very, very nice. This being our guest bedroom. Um, has two nice double beds. You can see Mikey's new sombrero. Um, I guess I would say that if anybody has a wild idea that they'd like to share this guest bedroom, they're welcome. Mi casa, your casa. has a set of generous closets, it has drawers and shelves inside. We have 
have a microwave oven. Brand new refrigerator. Actually, all the appliances in here are brand new. Um, kitchen sink. We have gas stove. I have to admit it's taken some getting used to, but now that I'm used to it, I really do like cooking on it. And the kitchen, in the kitchen I should say, is just the view outside of the kitchen window looking to the south. Um, you can see the capital city of San Jose. You look a little further southeast and you can see the town of Cartago that's mainly coffee. Uh, also, we have a nice little eating bar. That's basically where Velm and I eat breakfast every morning and play bones in the afternoon. And I have to admit that Velma is the bones champion. This being the kitchen, I think for myself is probably the favorite room in my in this house. Um, I just love this kitchen. It has probably one of the best views in the house. It's very, very functional. Um, we have all the luxuries of home. We have, and then the sliding glass doors that lead us inside. Look in the other direction on our patio. This is where we have our table chair where we can have our meals. Um, I do say that after two o'clock in the afternoon out here it's just too hot. You can't be out here from about two to five but that's usually when we go to town and have our meals. This is where I wish that I had a telephoto lens to put on this camera. Um, this is the view from our patio. For the most part, I guess the view just speaks for itself. It's um, still in the rainy season, so the tail end, so it's ever changing weather. You can just, any time of the day, it could be clear, it could be cloudy, it could be gray, it could be overcast. We haven't seen much rain, but I understand that this rainy season, they haven't had a lot of rain.